guys! So I thought I would try to take you through my first full week of online classes for college. Um, I'm sort of figuring out my routine as it comes. Um, every morning I have been making my coffee um, instead of grabbing from like my favorite coffee shop at school. I've been grinding up my own beans. I love the blue bottle coffee ones. Um, my dad and I both get them and we um, French press and I make um, a mug or two for me and some for my dad as well because um, he's working from home and I'm lucky that my family is very like safe and healthy um, so I just take my coffee upstairs to him and then some for myself and I sit down at my desk um, I of course have to start by getting my study vibe going so I have my music happening I added a bunch of new playlists um given the fact that I just have so much extra time right now to be making playlists I have been doing so I light my candle and then I have this weekly pad sticky note or not sticky note like a desktop pad that I got from Baron Fig I'll try to link things down below um if you guys are interested and then I just write out my to-do list for the day in my planner um, this was Monday, so I didn't really know how much I could tackle in a day. I worked on, um, a chapter reading for my religion class. We talk about, like, the history of religion and spirituality in America. So I'm doing some reading on that, and I try to have all my books be online as a typical thing, just because, first of all, they're usually way cheaper or free, um, and then... Afterwards, I take a little study break. I got an art print delivered. I've been trying to make my space really, really inviting, welcoming, matches my current vibe rather than my high school vibe. So I just put up an Enneagram Type 2 art print from 27 Kid, which I can link down below. I love her art and her, like, products. So then I'm just crossing off some things and going on to check email to post something on my Instagram for like my studying um, things, finishing up the second chapter that I had to read for my class. Um, and then afterwards, I'm just like continually checking off more things. Each of these take a long time. Um, I FaceTimed friends in between where I would normally take, like, a break for lunch to hang out with everyone. Um, then I went down and worked on my puzzle that I've been working on, my kitchen table. It has now been finished, which is great. Um, then after that little break, I went in and started doing my psychology notes that you've seen in my last video. So if you've seen that, you already know how my outlining goes. Um, it takes me a really long time to do each section, so I actually break it down um, in my to-do list. And so I work through that. I check my syllabus for my religion class, and then I'm listening to the audio file that my teacher gives us for our lectures. Um, and I just take notes on that like I normally would for class, cross that off, and honestly, at this point, I was exhausted. I had a long weekend, so I just called it a day at like 3.30. Next morning is Tuesday, and I kind of do the same thing. I make my coffee, I get out my planner, make a to-do list. I have sort of just been getting up between 9 and 10 a.m. and staying up kind of late at night. Um, when I'm at school, I get up at 5.45 in the morning and go to sleep, like, before midnight if I can. Um, that's not necessarily the case at school, um, as I can be at home. Um, none of my classes start until 2 p.m., so I just had been doing some reading while I eat breakfast, um, again, for my religion class. And then I'm just, like, kind of going through the motions of the same stuff. I um, am going and reading more things for my psychology chapter. Um, I'm going back and forth about some seminar work over email because my I have a once a week Monday seminar that was canceled the day before. So we were trying to figure out what work we needed to do for the next week. Um, and so um, yet again, I'm just crossing off everything. Um, I had gone to my philosophy class and um, my psychology lecture the day before that I just didn't film. And then Wednesday, I did the same thing, make a to-do list, got my coffee. Um, I attend another religion lecture, um, and he just records them and we watch whenever we want. 
um, or not watch, listen. Um, I get my study music ready again. I have a Bluetooth speaker that I've just been vibing with, um, have a candle going, have my coffee going. I'm doing more reading for my philosophy class um, and prepping for some discussion posts. Um, I'm listening to audio files that I had to download for my lectures once again. I had a lab meeting at 11 a.m. that day for... um, like over Zoom, trying to figure out when we're doing all of our work, because normally I work nine to one. Then I'm going through um, my lecture for psych, going through my lecture for religion. It's a Tuesday, Thursday class. And then I have a Wednesday night discussion for my religion class. So I attend that and I write some notes about everything. Next morning, it's Thursday. I got my breakfast going, my coffee going. Um, and I'm just checking emails. I'm going back and forth about some grant that I'm applying for. Um, I start another chapter for psychology reading. Um, I'm doing a little bit of online shopping. Everywhere seems to be having a sale right now. And then I slowly just keep crossing more things off that I'm doing. I read a like article for my lab. I watch another, um, lecture take notes I take my philosophy lecture notes on my computer actually because that class does allow it and like while I'm in the lecture so I've been enjoying that um and then I just worked on more psychology reading went to my psychology lecture and went through all of those slides watched all the video links that I'm required to for that and I ended the day probably at like 4 30 Next morning is Friday. I had some cold brew instead of my normal French press, got my breakfast going. Um, One of the perks of being at home, I guess. And I'm just making a to-do list. And all I had was a philosophy discussion. So I worked on watching the videos from my discussion TA and then writing a couple of paragraphs as a reflection and like analysis on the readings for the week. Um, Afterwards, just did some extra work on psychology reading and outlining and finishing that chapter. And then I just kind of worked on my YouTube stuff and had like a relaxing rest of my Friday. And then the weekends I tend to do less homework than during the week is what I've been seeing. Um, I hope you guys are all doing very, very well. And I'll talk to you in my next one. Bye, guys.